It's on, bitches. Oh, it's on. It's in there. Mugen. Guys, I'm freaking hyped, man. Uh, as you probably know by now, the next gacha that is coming out on, uh, on JP is the Lugetsu, Aizen, and Barrigan gacha. And these characters, they look amazing. <laughs> You just saw the footage I uh, had of their specials and some gameplay, and uh, I gotta give a shout out to Mark uh, over at KLab Global. Uh, he's the PR guy over there, and uh, I actually did get his permission to use uh, use video clips from KLab live streams and KLab, you know, just KLab media stuff. So um, shouts out to him. He's a super nice guy. Um, he's a big supporter of the community too. So um, thanks, Mark. If you see this, uh, appreciate it. All right, so uh, let's talk about the characters, guys. Do they not look amazing? I mean, you know, I, we, we don't know like the details of how they play yet, but from the little clips that they provided, K-Lab did, uh, they look pretty cool, man. Like, and as they should, because these are you know the pinnacle characters of the of the manga and up to this point. So I guess we'll do the usual thing. We'll take a look at the, the stats that we know of and um, you know just give you the quick rundown so you have a general idea. Uh, we'll know more about tomorrow. Um, you know, when, when stuff is translated and things like that. So let's take a look at that guy Ichigo first, or Mugetsu, whatever you want to call him right now. Um, he has 753 stamina, 550 attack, 284 defense, 237 focus, and 480 spiritual pressure. And those are his 5-star stats, guys. Um, you know, I don't know how people still care about 5-star stats, but um, they look pretty good for a 5-star. 5 550 attack is amazing for a 5-star. I think, yeah, that's got to be the highest in the game. I'm pretty sure. Uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't check, uh, I didn't check uh, to compare, but I'm fairly certain that is. Uh, he also has 20% normal attack damage. So, guys, he's a beast. Even as a five star, he's a beast. Um, yeah, I, I, it does raise some concerns about balance, but uh, I'm not going to get into that now. Uh, let's just appreciate what's going on. And uh, I put the six star stats below. So the six star stats, guys. This is incredible. Uh, incredible, but also, you know, like I said, is it gonna break the game? We'll find out. Um, he has 803 stamina. Guys, that's unbelievable. 645 attack. What? You know, like, what the? F I mean, I guess he is, he is Dangai Ichigo, but that's, that's freaking crazy. 294 defense, I mean, what, what what is going on here? Uh, 253 focus and 530 spiritual pressure. Like every stat for six star Mugetsu is just it's just ridiculous. I mean, you know, I don't need to I don't need to tell you guys that. I mean, just look at the numbers. It's crazy. Uh, you know what's it, what it's gonna do to balance? You know, uh, I don't know, man. But I'm still hyped. He looks awesome. All right. So uh, enough about him. Let's check out Aizen. So Aizen is, uh, he's a purple character. Um, that guy Ichigo, what was he again? He was a, he was a blue character, so. You, you, you kind of think he would be like, I don't know, you kind of think he might be like orange, because Aizen's like purple, but whatever, it doesn't matter. He is a speed character. He's gonna be the best blue in the game by far. Um, yeah, you know, if you're a hardcore PvP guy, you're gonna want all these characters. Well, at least uh, Mugetsu. I mean, who knows though? Because Hollow Ichigo turned out to be you know, kind of not that good in PvP, so I can't say anything like that yet. I'm gonna hold off, I guess. Um, Alright, so let's take a look at Aizen's stats. 
Uh, he's in that uh, kind of that half waveform. You know, he's not the full monster yet, but he's like not normal yet, normal either. So, I think it was a good choice uh, for the uh, for the gra for the design of him for the character to put. Um, I would still like to see like a normal like you know Aizen in his um, you know his normal Hueco Mundo clothes, but you know that that still might happen. Who knows? Um, let's see here. We have 758 stamina as a five star, 422 attack, which is you know, like what. 422 attack. Uh, although we did see in the footage, he is a ranged character, so you know that's the normal thing for ranged characters. Um, 293 defense, that's really high. 218 focus is low. 590 spiritual pressure as a five star, guys. That's uh, you know that's pretty freaking high as a five star. So as you can see, I put the six star stats below, and you know stamina 809, amazing. Attack 514 and for a range character, guys, that's that's really good. 514. Um, 303 defense. That's that's like pretty goddamn high. You know, it's like up there with near Sajin and all that. So that's a really good stat for him. 233 focus. You know, kind of kind of average. And 643 spiritual pressure, guys. So obviously this guy is a strong attack focused character. Um, you know, his normal attacks. You know, they're not they're not that uh, that strong but he is ranged guys so which is I, I don't know that's kind of weird that they would make him ranged but yeah it's whatever it seems like he's gonna be uh, he'll, he'll be a strong uh, PvE or raid character um, that's what I'm thinking at least from what we can see here his soul trait it's uh, it, guys it's 20% stamina recovery which is you know uh, you know it's kind of I don't know I don't know how I feel about it but it's definitely seems it definitely seems like he's geared towards um, uh, PVE content and raid content. So he'll dominate, you know, legendary raids or at least the ones that he has the attribute advantage or killer advantage. We don't know that information yet. Um, I'm sure people are translating it now, but uh, we'll have to see what, the, what his traits are. I'm assuming it would be he'd be a soul reaper or a captain killer, um, something like that, or he might be an everything killer. I don't know. I mean, he did like kill uh, Halibel, not kill, but he did attack her and stuff. But uh, anyway, let's move on to Barrigan. Now, Barrigan, guys, believe it or not, I'm more hyped about Barrigan than the others. Um, I don't know why, but like after seeing his gameplay footage, he looks like visually, he looks amazing. Um, I also, he's also like one of my like favorite Espada. You know, I have a lot of favorite Espada, I think, you know, but uh, he's up there too. He's just such a cool looking character. His powers are really interesting. So um, let's get into his stats. He has 775 stamina, uh, 451 attack, 304 defense, which is high for a five star. I mean, that's like, I think that's top for five star characters. Uh, 259 focus, so he crits a lot. That's great. And 474 spiritual pressure. And his, his soul trait, guys, is dodge. Like, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's cool. He's. I mean, any character with dodge is going to be pretty strong in PvP. And uh, this guy, yeah, he's uh, he's going to be a badass. And he looks beast, you know. He's got he's got the huge axe. He's got the you know the black clouds of Respira that he's spitting out. It just he's just like he's hype, man. He's hype. Um, 818 stamina as a six star, really good. 538 attack, good, good. Uh, 310 defense, that's awesome. So uh, 268 focus and 548 spiritual pressure. So overall, I guess, I think he's, he looks pretty well-rounded. Um, you know, nothing really too spectacular. His defense is awesome. I guess that is the uh, standout uh, stat on him. Um, but he also has, uh, you can see in the gameplay footage, he has a vortex uh, attack, which is uh, strong for uh, raids and PvE, and he's a red character. So um, yeah, he'll be awesome. He's gonna be, he's gonna be the man. Like 11% uh, dodge, you know, uh, is one of the best soul traits, if not the best soul trait. You know, it's it's starting to look like damage reduction might be one of the stronger ones, but dodge is still very, very good. And uh, did I mention that he looks like a freaking beast? Okay, just making sure. But uh, all right, guys, get hyped. You know, like uh, they'll do, pro probably do the uh, the test play tomorrow, and uh, we'll get to take a closer look at them. But for now, that's all I have, guys. Um, thanks again to Mark at K Lab Global. Appreciate it. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.